Do you care about a woman's body count? I don't care about a woman's body count. I got a whole lot of body count. So, being a woman, that doesn't really matter, brother. So, what's yours? I would say over 100. Over 100. Come here, come here. What are you doing? You got a hundred bodies? No, I never said that. He got a hundred bodies? That's what he just told me. A hundred? I never said that. Get your hand off of me. How many bodies you got? So, How many bodies you got? So you'd have fun with him. How many? Yeah, I would. How many bodies you got? Probably less than you. How you know that? I'm a married woman. Where's your husband? At home with my kids. Why do you, Okay. At home with my kids. So he doesn't care about the fact that you have a girls' no, night? No, he doesn't care. And, that, the, and no. the fact that you were just upon another random no, no, man? I mean, he probably would not like that part. It's okay. But he knows what he got, and he knows that I'm a badass. He knows, that, he knows that you're coming you home to him. Do, 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 do,
from time to time he get on the radio and apologize to her like that's how you know a dude is a sucker bro even if a man cheat you not gonna belittle me you not gonna have me go out my workplace and apologize to you on the radio station i'm not doing that but just because she can control her sucker she's a bit delusional man but fellas don't even entertain a woman if she's not gonna lay out the red carpet for you what a like a woman's job is to treat a man like a king like the only type of women who have this type of perspective are women that are usually single and who probably gonna be single for life and they're probably gonna stay in the streets or it's gonna be a woman who find a sucker because have you noticed right women who are with suckers they could hang with women who are for the streets because they damn near the same they just using this sucker until they tired of him but fellas the bottom line is this man if your woman don't treat you like a king as she's supposed to leave her ass alone and don't let a chick use you because that's all this chick is doing with the guy that she's with she's just using that fool and have him do whatever she want him to do sad is having a work husband or work wife a form of cheating yes no i don't yes. think so no. i don't think so no Kina says no Fonte. Yeah. He said, Fonte says yes. All right, let's dive into this. So you mean to tell me that you think it's cool for a nigga to just be buying your lunch and shit, covering your 62 breaks at work because you know he got a crush on you and shit. Now, let me say this. Now, as soon as your dude buy somebody lunch at work, your ass gonna be like, you better Man. take it back. Beat her. to be a, a work husband. I said it was okay to, to have a work husband. You better, you That's what better. I said. Now, now, you everybody. better cut it out. Can I say this? Sometimes the, uh, the, the man, the work husband, you know, he got big hips. Um, Maybe he. Kita. Ma no, what? You have to stop. Well, I'm saying it's never, it's you never have Denzel stop. Washington. That's your work husband. You know what I mean? It's Gary from accounting. Nobody's going to. Gary from accounting, babe. He just warmed up my salmon. It's not a big deal. Like, how? God, how? Oh, Fonte. Hey, no fake deep, bro. That's predatory as. Look, I'm just gonna keep it a buck with y'all, man. If your girl is working at a job where she's working amongst a bunch of dudes, it's a good chance that somebody at that job is going to fuck your girl. I'm just being honest, okay? Now, there are some jobs that are guaranteed that your girl will get fucked. If your girl is a nurse, somebody at a job probably already smashed or smashing. If she work at a call center, somebody already smashed or it's coming. If she work at Amazon, like one of those Amazon centers, <laughs> dog, it's almost inevitable because your girl is around that dude every day, bro. And what's even more crazy, he don't even have to spit game at your girl. He don't even have to go at your girl he just gotta come to work every day and just be himself and slowly but surely your girl is going to be drawn towards him if she likes what she sees that's how it works she's going to st start making small talk with that guy but the crazy part about it is when a woman is on the job a man don't even have to shoot <laughs> at her she just gotta relax because women be doing the most choosing at the job that's a fact bro it's going to be three four dudes who smashing all the bitches at the job because women love to compete Pete fam. A chick want to feel like she the baddest bitch at the job. So if all the chicks is going after that dude, she's going to feel like I could get that dude if I wanted. And before you know it, she's going to start competing with the other chicks to get that dude. And the thing about that dude, he's not going to make it official with none of those chicks. And he's not going to put one above the other. He is going to let them compete for his time and his energy because that's how it works on the job. Facts. <laughs> I'm just keeping it above, man. So if you a man out there and your girl is working around dudes, like if you dropping your girl off to work and you see a bunch of, and fellas, y'all know, like you know a player when you see one. So if you dropping like your girl off and you see a few smooth players like going up in that building, 
you're in trouble, bro. You're in trouble, boy. I'm, I'm just keeping it above because do you understand how loyal and disciplined your girl have to be to not cheat at the job? That man that she's looking at will be occupying her entire day. All she do is go home to your ass and sleep and wake up and go back to this dude. And if you get her upset, if when your girl leaves her job, she go home and she's mad at you, best believe she's gonna hand that dude at her job her pussy on a platter. Like, here you go. <laughs> Keep that in mind, fellas, all right? That's all I'm saying. You're not really a, a good catch because you got you so open for him. That's why I always say, guys, play hard to get. Show no emotion. The, the less emotion you show, the more guys will be on your body, sis. I promise. Because I do it. If you haven't yet, go get you some of that merch. You all already know, don't feed the birds. That's what it is. We don't feed the birds over here. So if you rock with your boy, go get you some of that good merch.